our very first New York Comic Con Funko Pop. And it's broken. What's up with that? Welcome back, everybody. It's your boy, David, from It's a Pup Thing. Thank you guys for checking us out over here on YouTube. Over there on Instagram, it's a pup thing. TJNG, or you follow us on Facebook at Fanatic Funko. Thank you guys for finding us wherever you see us on social media or find us on social media. I thank you guys for subscribing to the channel. And if you're new here, don't forget to go ahead and subscribe. And if you're already subscribed, don't forget to hit that notification bell so you can see new content like what we're going to do today with unboxing our first wave i will say it's only three in the second in the next wave but our first wave of new york comic-con fungal pops that happened i guess we got these on october the 8th we were um, lottery winners so uh these are the ones we got from the lottery and there's some stuff for me um stuff for some friends and um We'll just go ahead and start. So first up, which I showed you in the beginning, was the um, Dum Dums Drum Man with the official sticker. And it came with a, bro well, actually, I've already kind of doctored this because the arm is broken and that, and then the Dum Dums gone. I do have it, so I'm going to glue that back. Uh, so it would be the one that I really wanted uh, the most other than the Wonder Woman that would come in broken. So that's not fair, but that's the first one we that we got from the lottery. Mr. Dum Dum is a very cool looking ad icon, but mine is broken and you know you can never um, get these replaced because they sell out of everything. But other than that, the box was in really good condition and loving the the official New York Comic Con sticker. So that was number, that's number one. We'll put him in there. Um, just uh, so we know where he is so we can um, get him. We only had two damaged ones, like box-wise. Um, this one as well came with the New York Comic Con sticker, and it is the child. I picked this up for a friend, um, and the way one of the sodas were laying on here, it kind of dipped the the the, the box in a small little tear, um, but it still looks good. And this is the one with he has the child with what's it the child with pendant. I almost said necklace. The child with. Uh, pendant so that's that one and then the second one I picked up for my friend um, this is a deluxe pop from uh, the Princess Bride and it's the Andre the Giant physics is that physic is that physic I don't know the names I've seen this movie years ago um, I know it's Andre the Giant there's the side and then there's the back. These pops, and surprisingly, these 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 pops are old. These these are I mean, there's a chase of one of these, but these pops are old, and so coming out with this seemed a little odd. But there you go. But he looks really really good. The box is the box is great. Official sticker. I forget what they said about what pops. I have a few that have the um, the uh, shared exclusive sticker. And not the Comic Con sticker, and I thought everything was coming from the Comic Con shop. Everything was coming with their that you bought from the Funko shop came with the Con sticker, but who knows? So this was interesting. I did check everything to make this is also for a friend. Aren't I a good friend? I picked up a lot of pops from my friends, um, and I'm not even going to open. This came in a two pack was the Luke and Laura training um, and the plastic. I 
I guess that's how and it came with them. Um, oh, oh, I already messed that up because I got all this. No wonder it looked kind of hazy. Let's see. Hold on. <laughs> I don't want to mess them up because these are for friends. But I wanted to show you guys um, everything that we got on the, the, the lottery from Funko. I want you guys to see. So we'll do this. Ooh, 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 ooh. So yeah, I'm messing up. Hope that didn't come out. Um, there's a lot going on there. So it was so is a two pack and it came in a two pack protector. There's a little bit better uh, look at Luke and Laura. Um, as uh, in the Luke and say Luke Skywalker Jedi training and Princess Leia Jedi training. Does she train to be a Jedi? I, I mean, I, I haven't seen. This is a very long time, so I'm sure all my um, Star Wars fans knows exactly. There we go. Knows exactly what's going on. But um, nothing broken. Both of the um, uh, 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 the lightsabers are intact. We had a um, a Conan. I think my niece has it. Uh, a Conan um, pop as Jedi, and her uh, mine's didn't break, but her uh, lightsaber broke. So we'll be getting these to my buds this week um what else was it so we'll go with go with the stuff that wasn't mine and uh i got um these two these were the toy tokyo ones and they came out really well they actually they look really good i'm like those look really really good that was the um king his and ninjor from I guess mm, mm, these were Toy Tokyo exclusive, but we can get them on the Funko Shop, so I was able to grab those um, on the Funko Shop, and then also a GI Joe uh, Beachhead with the uh, con sticker. All this stuff came with con stickers, uh, the real, the official con sticker, and these at, at Target were horrible the day we went to Target, and also um, grabbed my buddy a and that has a Toy Tokyo sticker on it. A um, who is this? Spike or soda? They do have Chase very for one that didn't come in a box like this one, and then also I ordered myself a Shira too in the other um, second wave, which we'll be getting later this week, hopefully. Um, soda. So that is my other bud stuff. Hmm. And now. Uh, what I did get, and I'm gonna open this when I get my she my very first um, Freddy soda, and it was limited to 2,000 pieces in the 500 chases. So you have a one in four chance to get a chase, and you only get one. I could have bought one. The, no, the second day that the, they were all out, but um, it has the limited. I don't know if they have the official kind of stickers or not, but they had the limited stickers but there's the freddy soda that one is mine uh let's see you see dum dum oh and then the cayuga with the official con sticker looks really really dope you know a friend of ours had grabbed us one and i'm probably going to be doing a giveaway with that here pretty soon and the only one oh i forgot about this this is for another friend it was, uh, and then one I'm, what is already boxed up, it was the, the Pop Town for um, Harry Potter. I didn't want to unbox that. Um, and also there's a Harry Potter for a friend because I don't collect these. Uh, Mr. Ron Weasley. And I don't, wasn't, I don't know where, where that's from, but I know you Harry Potter people do. <laughs> I don't. Put him back so he's okay. And then only one, I, when I first looked at the box, I thought they were all in sorters, but they weren't. So... The only one that we that came in a sorter, the rest came in those the, the Funko shipping boxes uh, inside a bigger box. Uh, follow me on Instagram, you've seen that big box that came in. The only one that came in a sorter was the, um, really happy to get this one, was the um, Breast Cancer Research Foundation Pink Joker. I think he looks great. Um, one of the ones I wanted to have it does have the shared exclusive sticker on it um but these all have the original modes which was really really cool so 
like that. He looks very cool. Let it go with um, the Batman and um, my, uh, I have them all now, but Harley. So if I can find a Harley at Walmart, I'll go ahead and pick her up to complete the set. And then my favorite pop from what I ordered uh, would probably have to be the one that I was really waiting for. And we'll do a glow in the dark on this was the Wonder Woman WW84 action pose. You can see her in there. We're not going to take her out just yet. We'll do a review on all these. Um, these sold out at Barnes & Noble. And um, I was happy to grab her. I was surprised I even got... Well, I wasn't too surprised that I got on the Funko Shop. But um, a lot of people didn't. So she actually sold out. This is probably one of the better Wonder Woman poses. And making it glow in the dark. Um, this is my... Oh, it does have damage. Look at that. I didn't see that at first. Dang, Funko. Mm, mm, mm. Got to be more careful. See, if I do was gonna come damaged, I would have bought more. I, I was there at, at Barnes Noble that morning, but um, dang, look at that. No way to change this box, but it's for my. I have a ton of. One of these things I'm gonna go over my whole Wonder Woman pop collection so you guys can see it. Let's see. Um, then my next favorite would probably is the damn it is the Venomized Magneto. I have just about all, every one in this set. Uh, I think I'm missing the Jumping Venom. I think that's the only one I'm missing from this set. So yeah, look at that. They should have made this glow in the dark. It could have it could have been really, really dope uh, glow in the dark, but check it out. So we got him as well. Uh, and then the very popular sticker Danny Phantom I've seen people do reviews on this and this pop looks really really good we're going to go over all these eventually um, when I get some time I've been working a lot this weekend this past weekend um, but yeah kind exclusive Danny Phantom everybody wanted this one the ones at my local target because if you see the past video they were all beat up and um, but I was cool because I knew I had this one um on order he could have been glow and dark too but looks amazing really cool danny phantom um let's see and then we get the con my to hot topic had a ton of these left i don't think there's any left now but they had a ton before um con sticker nightwing will go with my other i'm going to do a review on the other two that i have of the nightwings and different outfits so Pretty cool con sticker, um, Nightwing. And then the last one for our first wave of Funko Pop New York Comic Con exclusives is the Red Goblin with the con sticker. So um, yeah, so those are all the ones we got. We'll do in-depth reviews on all of these. The next video will open up all right, we, I got a she and we'll open up Freddy Funko. So send me some chase vibes for that. Didn't want the video to go too long. So thank you guys for watching and seeing what we got in our first wave of the New York Comic Con Funko Pop exclusives. Tell me in the comments below what you got up and what was your favorite pop from the con? Was it Wonder Woman? Was it Venomized? Um, Venomized Magneto, one of the, uh, the, the ad icons, Dum Dum, Dum Dum's drummer guy. I think it's what it's called, or something else that I didn't mention or you didn't see here on the on the channel today. But thanks again for all the love, for all the support, and I will see you on the next video. Peace.